Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Addison396 and today I'm going to teach you a tutorial on how to stick your own flag design in Kerbal Space Program. So to do this you need to locate your Kerbal Space Program folder, it'd be different depending on where you've installed it. My advice is to buy the game legitimately and then torrent it as you'll be able to install it wherever you want and have a lot easier access to it. So you basically need to locate your Kerbal Space Program folder and uh, locate the game dat or game data folder. And inside that, go to squads, and then once you've double clicked on that, there'll be a folder called flags. Now, let's bring up all the flags in the game. As you can see, uh, the, the last one there is my logo that you've just seen at the beginning of this video. And um, yeah, th these are all the flags in the game. So, what you want to do is you want to right click one of them and click on edit, and it should bring you up in paint. And from there on, as long as you don't edit the dimensions of that canvas, you should be fine to design your own flag. That's the easiest way to get the. the you know the correct canvas dimensions so as you can see here I'm going to design an amazing flag so whilst I'm doing that I just wanted to give you a quick note on uh, on piracy and, and DRM so there are two occasions when it's okay to uh, torrent or to steal I suppose because uh, piracy is is stealing but apart from these two cases so if you have uh, the game already and you've already bought it and you want to back it up um, that's when it's okay as long as you delete the, uh, the the torrented version after you have deleted your game or sold it on, and obviously if you're unable to access the content legally, then it's um, usually seen as okay. It depends on your local laws, but it's usually seen as okay to torrent it then. So that's my little uh, two bit on torrenting. Basically, for this for this the reason why I'm telling you that is it makes it easier to locate your game data folder. So once you've done with your once you've done with your flag, you basically want to save as. Uh, and that'll create, give it a different name. Here I called it my amazing flag, and uh, basically just save it as, and it should load up in the uh, the Kerbal Space Program as long as you save it as, uh, you know, the correct format. Just keep it the same basically, and as long as you save it in the correct folder, keep that the same, and you should be all good. So I'm just going to switch to the game now, show you that amazing flag. So here we are in game, and you can see I've uh, selected the flag there for career mode use. And uh, yeah, it looks pretty cool. So have fun sticking your own flags in Kerbal Space Program. Thank you very much for your time, guys. Take care, and I'll see you in my next video.